you know, I used to suffer from these great big troughs of debilitating depression. In this video, I talk briefly about mental health, depression, psychotherapeutic counselling and meditation. I'd become a parent, I'd got divorced, I'd had uh, psychotherapeutic counselling, which uh, changed my life forever. And then after that, I felt like I needed something else, something to help sort of consolidate everything I'd learned about psychology and my own psychology and my, my, uh, my childhood and my triggers and what works for me and what doesn't work for me in terms of trying to stay happy and uh, secure and uh, sort of balanced. Uh, and that was when I discovered Transcendental Meditation. So essentially just meditation, 20 minutes twice a day. And I've been doing that ever since. And that has changed my life too. Lowers anxiety, uh, helps you sleep better, helps you concentrate. So if you are like me, if you have thoughts flying around your head, sort of like a washing machine or a whirlwind or a hurricane, meditation is incredibly helpful calms everything right down, helps you concentrate, you feel much more clear-headed and, you know, just makes you happier. Some people say, oh, I haven't got time, 20 minutes twice a day, I haven't got time for that. And I say to them, well, do you want to feel the way you feel 24 hours a day? Or do you want to feel much, much better for 23 hours a day? <laughs> I'd go for the second option. Uh, another thing people say, oh, I've tried meditation, I just couldn't concentrate because they have the idea that perhaps you're supposed to just be able to think about nothing for 20 minutes. But a much better way of thinking about it is that you are practicing the art of meditation. You're not mastering it, you're practicing it. So you try, try not to think and try to just think about your mantra, repeat your mantra in your head to give your brain something to do. And every now and again, you'll think, oh, hang on, I'm thinking about something. I'm thinking about that report I have to do, or that strange thing that Jane said to me the other day. And then you think, oh, right, okay, push those thoughts to one side, go back to your mantra. I think, if I need to think about that, I will think about it later. I don't need to think about it right now during my 20 minutes of meditation. And that's that. So you have these moments of peace, and then these moments of accidentally daydreaming about things. Let's go and see the river. When you catch yourself daydreaming about things or thinking about things, you can just put those thoughts to one side and carry on with your mantra. And by the end of the 20 minutes, have you managed to empty your mind? Not necessarily, but you've had moments of absolute stillness. So you have some peace and quiet, which really helps. And you feel calmer, you feel better, you feel more relaxed. Just 20 minutes a day, of trying to put thoughts to one side and breathing deeply. Okay, so that really helped me. It helped me an enormous amount. You know, I felt like a different person, really. You don't need an external locus of validation. You need an internal locus of validation. You need to, you need to love yourself before you try to love anyone else. And you need to, uh, you need to be happy with what you're doing. If you're making you're making anything. You need to do it because you love doing it. 